the creator of and voice for Lady Penelope from the Thunderbirds. Oh, gosh. Oh. Sylvia Anderson will be with us. She's flown all the way from London for the appeal. Oh, dear. I, I feel like Ronnie Corbett on an acid trip at the moment. Peculiar, but when I was a boy, one woman and only one woman was the object of my lurid sexual fantasies. <laughs> Lady Penelope, the drop dead gorgeous piece of plastic from the Thunderbirds. Sure, she was only a puppet, but damn it, we could have been so beautiful together. And tonight, what I want to know is could it have worked? What was she really like? To answer that question, the creator and voice of Lady Penelope, Sylvia Anderson. A little gift for you. A T-shirt for me. A T-shirt, oh, and you can auction it if you like for oh, the no, Jupiter gonna, Fun. You, oh like no, you're kidding! That. I'm too cheap. I'm going to keep this. Thanks. <laughs> but, but thanks for your concern and thanks for coming in tonight. Now you are who? There she is. There's Lady Penelope. There she is. She's marvellous, isn't she? Oh, all oh. these years. I mean, she's still a not sexy a line. Dame. Nothing. No, nothing. Nothing. Does nothing she, at all. Does she have human surgery as opposed to plastic surgery? <laughs> Absolutely. And all I can say is <laughs> the jokes are flowing oh, thick and yes, fast here yes. tonight. All I can say is that you were the original person to practice safe sex. Because I love Lady Penelope. <laughs> I mean, Rich, Richard suggested I ask this question, and it's a fair one. I know she. She is, or was a puppet, but was she yes. wooden in bed? <laughs> I can't answer things like that. I no. mean, you know. But really. she's a foxy. I mean, she's a lady. She is a lady. Well, she's That's Lady right. Penelope. And incidentally, she's sent for international rescue. Really? For Jupiter. Oh, it's that's just. Oh, I mean, it's perfect. That is it's so perfect. beautiful. Right? That is FAB. FAB. Absolutely. Absolutely. Look, FAB. Look at this. This is. Can I touch? You may, yes. Okay. The, my, yes. the hormones are coursing through every inch of my body right now. <laughs> this is uh, a real uh, animal that was once free and I'm running gaily around the forest. Yes. 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 yes, yes, yes. It was 1964. Yeah. So we weren't politically correct no, no, in no. those days. You know. But that's impressive. And she smoked. She smoked. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, so she's probably got a, a plastic carcinogenic lung in there. <laughs> Something like that. That's not a nice thought for Lady <laughs> Penelope, is it? She's met royalty, has she not? Oh, absolutely. Of course. Absolutely. Which one? It wasn't Prince Charles. He bought, this wasn't you who Prince it. Charles has been sleeping with. <laughs> we didn't want to reveal it. No, I should but hope not. But we thought maybe on the Andrew Denton show we could Well, why not? This. If Ivan Lendl's a woman, we can learn about Absolutely. that here. <laughs> um, who did she meet? She met them all? Well, actually, uh, in his heyday, Prince Philip. Really? Yes. He a new, had a heyday? There's a new... <laughs> I should say he did. I missed, yes. I missed that day, obviously, yes. <laughs> there's a new book coming out, but I promised... Well, everybody that I wouldn't talk about royalty when I was in Australia. Oh, no, it's okay, because we like to have a laugh. Oh, you do? Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, are you, a, are you a strong monarchist? No, not necessarily, but, you know, it's the county set, and Lady Penelope, Crichton Ward, and all that sort of thing. I understand that, yeah. Third cousins, you know, is intermarrying, this... all that sort of thing. So was she friends with Prince Philip? Because he was a, la he is a ladies' man. Friends, in, yes. Yes, 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 friends. In, in the purely friends. plastic yeah, sense. Yeah, in purely plastic sense. Yeah, absolutely. 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 absolutely, absolutely. Now, I once saw Lady Penelope do the foxtrot. I can only assume that's very, very difficult for a puppet. The foxtrot? The foxtrot. Andrew, that's dating you a little bit, isn't it? Well, yeah, look, I, yeah. No, I, I was trying to date Lady but Look, I was four and I was desperately in love with this puppet. It's true. She was the first woman I was ever interested in. And she's given me more response than most of them. <laughs> You're breaking out into a sweat as you talk about this. Oh, and it's it's yes. that's, that's not... Behind those glasses. Th those are hormones. They're they actually... are, definitely. And you've got a red spot. Oh, sorry. No, no. It, it's, it. yeah, for yeah, some right. people, this would be a beauty spot. For me, it's an ugly spot. I'm sorry oh, about that. Never. Do she, how hard is it to make a puppet dance the foxtrot? Impossible. Oh. I think... What did I see? <laughs> it's one of your fantasies. I think... One... <laughs> She's right. Would you like to tell us about your fantasies, Andrew? I am English? telling you about my fantasies. <laughs> I would have thought puppet sex is pretty interview. unusual fantasy, right. frankly. So. This sort of goes out late. I mean, it's live, so you can say what you like. Come on, Andrew. Uh, uh, no, 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 don't, no, no. don't do please. it to me, please. <laughs> because it involves a rotwheeler as well, and we don't want to hear about it. I knew I shouldn't have said no, this. No, well, you I pushed, knew. you pushed. I pushed. Let's I pushed. move on to something cleaner, That's which right. was Lady Penelope's recent comeback, which was her yes. appearance on Absolutely Fabulous. We have a clip of it here. It's beautiful. 
It's absolutely fabulous. It is. <clears throat> oh, take more than two of those to not. <laughs> Adina, my dear. It's sad news, I'm afraid. The doctors say there is nothing they can do. Brains is working on the formula, but he may not have enough time. I'm very sorry. Your friends and family, my dear. Yeah. That was such a moment when I saw that. Tell me, is, is Lady Penelope... Is Lady Penelope like a major cult figure in England? She is, actually. Yeah. Yes. She and Parker, of course. She, oh, Don't Parker. forget Parker. No, I mean, Parker Parker's outside now, parking the Rolls. In the, ro you know. the Rolls Royce. Yes. You must the say Rolls, Rolls Royce. Royce. Yes. Yes. yes, yes. Fab one. Look, yes. I can't tell you, it's just been a childhood fantasy come true. And sadly, it's still an adult one. That's the really pathetic part. <laughs>